How's my hair look? Like you need a haircut? How many times am I gonna tell you that? Like, I mean, he likes to get it. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is actually Saturday morning. I am on my way to work right now. April went to a meeting at 7 o'clock in the morning. We were actually late to the meeting. We were there at 7.30. But still, we got there in time for her to be able to be part of the girls' camp that she was called to. Um, since then, I actually did a lot of catching up on some necessary reading and studying that I needed to do. Studying for my pharmacy book, studying from like the scriptures and things like that. And I'm going to continue to study that throughout the day. Hello, my friends. Today is Saturday, and this is my first clip of the day. It's 3 o'clock, 2.44 to be exact. Just got home from a huge, it's called Super Saturday. It's like a huge collective meeting for girls camp where the girls come and they do certification and they have skits and we have breakfast and we have lunch and it's pretty much like an all day thing. So I was there from 7.30 until about 2 o'clock and it was still going on but I came home early because most of the things that I was in charge of doing was pretty much over. So basically I'm on like the program committee so we we basically do all the programming stuff so we come up with the schedules of the girls camp what's going on each day we um, kind of go over like the different levels I don't know if any of you guys have been to like a girls camp or any of you who are LDS if you've probably gone to girls camp but we go over the different levels and what certifications need to be be done for those levels and then we also put on an actual program of whatever the theme is and this year the theme is like a service thing I forget exactly what it is but it's about service and our like whole theme is kind of like based on the Lorax and it's really fun really cool I don't know if I'm gonna be vlogging up at girls camp or not I haven't quite decided if I will be doing that I might but not 100% sure yet. Hopefully I'll be able to because I think it would just be a lot of fun to show you guys how my week's going, you know, kind of what we do at girls camp, interacting with the girls and the service projects that we're doing, which I think is going to be so much fun, so much fun this year. So yeah, I think it's going to be a lot of fun and hopefully I'll be able to take you guys along. But mom and I are just getting ready now. I'm going to go get changed. We're going to go to the gym and do some swimming. Look at this delicious dinner. It's kind of similar to what we had for lunch the other day. But instead of tuna salad, it's chicken salad with, what was in it again? It was, um, grapes, grapes apples, mm -hmm. celery, um, walnuts, and craisins. That sounds delicious. And then she made these potatoes, which is just delicious. Cottage fries. Apparently they're called cottage fries. I did not know it. They're delicious. They're delicious. They're delicious. How many times do you guys say that? They're delicious. <laughs> Happy Father's Day, everybody. Today is Father's Day, and I'm going to give my own little Father's Day welcome to my dad. Happy Father's Day, Dad. I know you watch my videos, so I'm going to let you know that I love you and that I'm grateful for all that you do. Father's Day to me is just one of those times when you can be grateful that um, you have somebody in your life who... For, especially for us guys, who you can go to and who has been where you've been at in your life, who has been in, especially with me, I'm the splitting edge of my dad, essentially. The way we think, the way we act, a lot of times we're very, very similar, so I have a chance to go to him and get advice from him, and I'm grateful that I have that in my life. So thank you, Dad, and I love you, and happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day! Do you guys know that song where it's it's on um, the 25 days of Christmas where it's like Happy Holidays, but it's Happy Father's Day! Daddy, I gotta come give you kisses even though I already did. Hey, you're not eating your breakfast smoothie. Just oh, you drink about half of it. How's it? How is it? Good. Can I give you a Father's Day kiss? Father's Day kisses! Mwah. Love you. Good morning with my messy hair. <laughs> um, 
I haven't washed my face or showered or anything because we're about to go to the gym. This is like, you're going to hear this every day because we're going to go to the gym every day, five days a week or six days a week. So, that's going to be kind of everyday morning. Hey, good morning. We're going to the gym. We're going to the gym. We're going to the gym. We're going to do that every morning, just so you guys know. <laughs> Um, today is a busy, busy, filled, packed day. We're going to the gym. We're going to do some stretching. We'll probably show you guys a stretching because Doug wants to do that because he's weird like that. And Doug has to go to the school. Hey, we're going to the and... gym. <laughs> oh, you can't see it. There you go. Hey, we're going to the gym. <laughs> Hey, we're going to the gym. <laughs> so Doug has to go to the school after we go to the gym. He's going to come home and shower and then we're going to go. Or he's going to go. Um, we're going to film a couple videos today, which is going to be kind of fun. I'm trying to make sure that you got some light on you. There you go. Oh, and at and last, I am the light. We're going back to the gym this evening to go swimming. So we're going we're gonna to go twice a day. That's our schedule. Mornings, we're going to do strength training and... Um, like flexibility and things like that. Um, we're gonna use the machines and stuff. And then in the evening, we're gonna do our swimming because I enjoy swimming at night. It helps me relax, helps me get tired. And so um, that's definitely something that we're gonna be doing. I'm actually sitting here in front of Savers. I'm about to drop off some stuff that we had picked up and put in piles yesterday, put in bags. I'm getting rid of some clothes. April's getting rid of a couple dolls. We're getting rid of some books that have been lying around that we're not going to read anymore. And there's a strange guy walking up past me and walking on the side of me right now who's just very sketchy looking. <laughs> That's always creepy. <laughs> Anyway, so we're just getting rid of some things and giving them to Savers. <laughs> I have so many 30% off from Savers now. I might just go in and walk around as well because I want to see what ties they have. Already, we just got you that stuff. Seriously? I use it every day. Seriously? I am tired. Um, Doug's heading out to work. He's doing his hair right now. He is serving tonight, so he won't be taking you guys along with him. But you guys can hang out with me instead. I'm gonna go take a nap, so I guess we won't hang out that much. <laughs> um, and then after my nap, Mom and I are gonna go do some grocery shopping and then we're going back to the gym and doing some swimming, which will be fun. Well, hey there, guys. I just got up from my nap. And because of that, I missed going grocery shopping with my mom. I was just way too tired, so I wasn't able to go. She's in there putting the rest of the groceries away. And it's basically dinner time now. So we're going to eat, and then we're going to head out to the gym and do some swimming, which I think will be so nice kind of relaxing, a relaxing sort of workout, which is something that I kind of need right now. Good morning, today is Wednesday, and I'm not actually making it to the gym this morning because I'm letting my muscles kind of relax. They've been really sore. So I'm taking a little bit of a break from doing some strength training. Doug and I are gonna go do some swimming when he gets home from work. He's over here getting ready. I didn't work out this morning either. I woke up with a cramp in my legs and so I decided to do some stretching instead. Yeah, I still need to stretch for the morning and I need to go get some breakfast, take my medications. So yeah, it's kind of a late start today. I woke up at 10 o'clock, which was much needed. The last few days I didn't get a full eight hours of sleep. So I feel actually really good about <laughs> getting a full eight hours today. This is boring. Yay, I'm on my first delivery of the day. And it's not four o'clock. It's one o'clock. Woo! The uh, endure cool that I got in my head, I love it. Helps keep me cool throughout the day, even though I may look a little silly. I'm cool, even though it's, it says it's 121 degrees right now, which is hot. This keeps me cool. We're having baked potatoes. 
I realized that I have not really eaten much today. And according to my Fitbit, I've burned 35 calories. I doubt I've even taken a thousand calories into me. These are gonna be kind of like potato bar. We got hamburger, we got cheese, we got broccoli, we got butter, we got some cream, we have chives. I think that's all we really need. Well, the, the beef you're talking about is actually ground turkey and sausage. Yeah. So, yeah, it's actually, it's actually really, really good and delicious. But I'm going to eat a lot of food right now because I am hungry, 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 hungry. And you, work, you worked out pretty hard today. And I worked out pretty hard today. Yeah, that, class, that class just was, whew. Oh, my goodness gracious me. It was unexpected. Ooh, this looks yummy. This is what my husband made for me for lunch. We had a late start this morning. I was actually supposed to go get my blood work done, but... And that was at like 7 o'clock in the morning. 8.15. 8.15. Okay, so we would have had to be up at 7. And we didn't wake up till 11. That's how pooped we were from yesterday. Yesterday's workout. And then we stayed up kind of late. We watched a movie last night. It was really fun. Hi, robot. Yeah, we haven't watched a movie together in a long time mm -hmm. as a family. Yeah. So it was kind of nice just relaxing and watching a movie together. But that kind of made us sleep in a little bit. It did. <laughs> so it's like 12 o'clock now and we're barely starting the day. Yeah. Oh well. Unfortunately, so we're probably gonna do everything tomorrow we need to do. Yeah, we'll probably have to go do my blood work and everything tomorrow. So, anyway, today's just kind of relaxing day. Doug has a day off. We're gonna go to the gym in a little bit. Yay. A few hours, get a little bit of a workout in. And we need to focus on YouTube. We, it's been so long. So this whole week, we've been kind of neglecting doing anything recording YouTube. videos. Um, I don't know, commenting people commenting back, back, watching, watching videos. videos, like, we haven't done anything. So I think we're gonna just chill for an hour or two, watch some videos, comment people back, and then we're gonna head out probably to the gym and do like a little one, bit of a workout. Like two, three o'clock? Yeah, it's gonna be like three. Yeah. Ooh, scratch! Ooh, We scratch. still have that, uh, Ooh, that scratch. sausage and Ooh, that scratch. turkey, oh, ground turkey. so good. Oh. I don't know why I have these on. You like it? Good song. We found a song that works for us. For our video that I'm working on right now. I wanted to update you guys on my Misfit, kind of the progress that I've had for the last three days. I am extremely proud of myself. Now, I haven't really seen like too much weight loss, but as far as the points and calories and steps and miles I've gone, this is super exciting. I posted a picture on Instagram when I met my goal of a thousand points. Now this was Monday. So this was Monday. My points was 1,276. I walked or ran or exercised 3.1 or 3.8 miles, 4,180 calories, 10,280 steps. This was Tuesday. 1,140 points out of 1,000, 3.2 miles, 4,120 calories, 8,772 steps, and then this was yesterday's, 1,083 points, which all I did was really go to the, the class, and I that helped me burn so many calories. I would think it was like a 45-minute class, and we it was kind of unexpected because it wasn't something that we were actually planning on doing but they had the class going and we joined in and it was a lot of fun but it helped me reach my goal which is so exciting because it's the only exercise I did yesterday. How are you feeling today? Not real good. My legs are very sore to the point where I can barely go up and down the stairs. Yeah. Tammy did tell me not to overdo it yesterday. The trainer. I think I did. Yeah, you went and you went and did some strength training after a 35 minute, 40 no, minute I workout. Didn't do strength training. I oh, I was just doing. You tried stretches. doing squats though. I did one and then couldn't even get back up from it. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I think it was the water aerobics that did it. Yeah, that was fun though. We had fun. What you making, honey? I'm making. I'm cutting up some onions right now to make stir fry veggies, so we can have some good veggies with our dinner. And then over here, what we're making with our fancy little machine here, turkey and sausage burgers with cheese. And then in here we have buffalo cauliflower. Yummy. Ooh, that's steam. Woo! Ooh, it's hot today. Oh Good morning, gosh. guys. Today's Friday. I just got out of my ultrasound, um, and they're just going to look at the pictures and 
tell me if everything's okay. I am, I'll probably have to come back in a couple weeks from now and talk to the doctor. She's supposed to call me, so we'll see what happens. Hopefully it's nothing too serious and they can get it taken care of, but we'll see. I want that car. They have a pink soul. We have to zoom in. They have a pink Kia soul. Honey, I need that car. Okay, let's just marvel at its glory. Oh my gosh. How stinking cute! And it was a guy driving it too. And a guy driving it. <laughs> How funny. Oh my gosh. No. That's hysterical. No, I'm not driving a pink car. Yes, yes. We're getting a pink Kia Soul in the future. No. For me. For me. And the kiddos. When we have kids. They're going to love driving around. If we have little girls, little boys are going to love driving around in a little hot girls, pink baby. car. Little boys probably not. I want that hot pink car. I want that hot pink car. So I'm just here at Kohl's right now. We're going to get a uh, mattress. Not cover, but a, uh, like a pillow top, I guess you can say. A little foam mattress to get on, go on top of a bed because... We can now feel the wood planks on the, uh, on the, uh, what's the thing called? Box spring. Yeah. Alright, so here at the, the, uh, mattress toppers. This is the one that I really, really wanted. It's a gel one. Fortunately, they don't have the queen size, which is what our bed is. So, we're probably going to get this guy right here. This is one of the only ones that actually has our size. And it's, uh... Pillow top with an actual two two layer memory foam. It's really really comfy. I just plucked my eyebrows, but I can never really get the tail end right here very well. Well, I haven't done my eyebrows in I don't know how how long ages. like like a few months probably. Ages. It's been ages. 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 Um, so we're getting ready to film a Fluffy Files video, and then after that, we're going to the gym. So I just decided, no makeup today, and since it's Fluffy Files, I think I'm going to continue to do it without makeup, just because that's what I normally look like when I go to the gym, and when I work out, and when I talk about workout stuff, I'm usually not wearing makeup, because really, who wears makeup to the gym? Oh, I wanted to put up the silver. Yes, I know. Well, okay. What married girl wears makeup to the gym? I don't know very many. And if you are, you're going for the wrong reasons. Come on, you're going there to sweat and get nasty. You don't need your makeup caking up and running down your face. Girl, it's just not worth it. It's just not worth it. It costs so much money to buy makeup, so why you put it on when you're going to sweat it off? Yeah, basically. That's yeah. basically my theory. So we're in here, and we're taking care of business. Well. He's so funny. My honey's home and uh -huh. I'm doing a coconut oil hair mask because the chlorine has been killing my hair. Um, but we got something cute got in the mail. In the mail. So we, because we have been buying cameras, we bought Two like three, no, actually three. Three cameras. three cameras in the last couple months. Every time you buy a camera from Best Buy, they give you a free Shutterfly book. And I could not for the life of me think about what I wanted to like make a book into. But we had our honeymoon pictures and we haven't done anything with them. So we compiled all of our honeymoon pictures into this cute little book this that we got front, for free. This is the front cover. This is the back cover. Both of the same San Diego temple where we were visiting for the, the Sabbath day. Yeah, on our honeymoon. On you our are honeymoon. you're sweaty. Are you hot? It was hot outside. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look at that. I like that picture. We're not gonna go through every single page. Of course but not, but I'm going to. This is my favorite picture. So this out, outer ring here that you see that's out of focus. This is actually Doug's wedding ring mm -hmm. that he's wearing right there. And then we got the picture. So it looks weird though, cause it's yeah, the but book cuts it off. But I this is actually it. one of my favorite pictures mm -hmm. out of like all the pictures that I've probably taken of temples and. Photography wise, that's probably one of my favorites because just like symbolizes everything encompassed into his wedding like having his wedding ring there just encompasses like the importance of temples and families forever and things like that. So I love it. I love it. Eventually I want to get it framed and blown up on a big canvas when we get our own house and have it there. I like that. Our From the beach. Making a heart. Yeah, that was when we went to the beach. Yeah. This was actually on Memorial Day and it was so packed, so we went to like a smaller part of the beach. We tried going to Mission Beach in San Diego, California on Memorial Day. Yeah, what crazy. What were we thinking? <laughs> <laughs> so we went to this little part where they didn't have that many people and we could kind of be by ourselves and mm -hmm. took that picture of both our feet. Yeah. Okay, let's pause because we need to actually end the vlog. 
Okay. So let's pause. Put this down. Put this okay. down. I know you're so excited. I'm excited. You also need to eat dinner. You I know. Need... Oh, we had salmon. We had grilled salmon, um, tater tots, and we had veggies, but I got him some some fruit there. But we're going to end the vlog because... We're ending the vlog. We have a lot of clips and stuff that I have to go through. Oh, I, I'm filming you still. Okay. okay. So anyway, um, yeah, we're going to end the vlog. We will see you guys next week. Next week. Love you. We Bye. love you. Bye-bye.